Kelns, uh, and this player goes test will be taking a look at Jeff Renee out of the lane. The 17-year-old Cam, who sets at a 62 overall. Uh, his stats are pretty interesting. You see the dribbling is very high. Uh, decent pace. Agility, uh, of course, can be worked on with the beat your man Drew as well. But uh, we'll have to take a look at his stats as play information. Excuse me. For a 6-foot Cam, right winger, right foot with medium, medium work rates, 3-star weak foots, and 3-star schemas. Weird to see such a, a low ball control. So his first touch may not be the greatest due to that. It's kind of weird uh, to think about, you know, the fact that he'll be able to dribble pretty good, but he may have trouble uh, controlling those passes into him. But uh, we'll have to see how he ends up growing over the years. He unfortunately did pick up an injury at the end of that first season. If you do want me to turn injuries off, I certainly could do that. But, I mean, injuries happen in game, uh, you know, when you guys are playing, unless you guys turn injuries off too. But uh, I think, you know, I should keep it on. But that's up, certainly up to you. So he unfortunately did lose some uh, a drop a little bit in his physical stats. Uh, but he... Uh, ended up growing still fairly steadily uh, a plus three at the end of that second year age 19 a lot of improvements to the dribbling and short passing is pretty good to see uh, now you see 70 overall the dribbling is all the way at an 81 passing has improved quite a bit long passing short passing are very solid at the moment still very low with the attack position as I say vision I wish it was a little bit higher uh, the mental stats lagged quite a bit to say in general uh, you can see the attack vision is still uh, at a very fairly low mark, you know, for a 73 overall player. I think if that would have been higher, the vision would have been, been a bit high, bit higher. He would have had a much higher overall at the end. Uh, we'll see where he ends up capping out, though, after we take a look at his highlights first. He had quite a few highlights. I mean, he was a pretty solid player, I have to say. I think, you know, he'd be really good to bring in, you know, on a uh, kind of a, in a Road to Glory style series. Uh, as he ended up scoring a pretty nice goal there, as you can see. Uh, his long shots weren't the greatest, but they ended up being okay. And the end but still you can see the dribbling uh, on showcase there pretty solid dribbling and a decent finish uh, as well but uh, again I think you know he'll be a good road to glory style player he plays some tremendous passes uh, and then he can kind of you know train up to have you like and I think you'll really be able to get him a lot higher over uh, you know higher than his potential with training he'll look a lot better uh, with all the beat your man drill you know getting his finishing up his mental stats up the vision up I think it'll really help a lot but uh, he's played some amazing passes at the say uh, throughout but you can also run at the defense a little bit uh, you can see him eventually you know playing the ball through there very good work from him uh, creates kind of a half chance in the end but still looking very good uh, running at the defense again playing a perfect pass out wide perfectly weighted I really enjoyed his passing uh, it's just he did not have as high as an overall as, as I would have hoped because of his mental stats really lagging quite a bit in a very good pass ends up creating a very nice goal which you'll end up seeing you know I think either Tuesday or Wednesday uh, in the Jordan I video I'll be doing uh, as well so uh, you get a bit of a preview there basically um, and you see him coming in good little in these tight little spaces just occupying three defenders he takes out three defenders all that space and ends up creating a goal because of all those players that he was able to occupy there uh, and you know get out of that little situation where he's basically triple teams uh, in the end uh, he actually you know actually finished his, his finishing <laughs> was very poor had to say in the end as well but he was able to get that chance you can see the finishing is pretty low his, his stats are kind of are kind of weird I have to say again the pace is good uh, the agility is not too bad the stamina is fairly low I have to say again the attack position isn't that good the vision is a bit low uh, maybe for a cam which is a little bit higher if his attack vision and vision more higher I think he would you know be get be able to get up to like a 80 or so uh, but unfortunately that was not the case and again the ball control is fine, kind of low as well but we'll have to take a look at his uh, stats uh, in the calculation 75 as a winger 76 as a center forward 70 as a cam 76 as a center mid and 76 as a right mid left mid I think he's gonna be really perfect for Road to Glory style career I think he'd be a lot better if you trained him yourself as well uh, but either way he's still turned a very good player I did enjoy my time using him he had some very good passing uh, was had some very good dribbling as well ran out defenders pretty nicely and created some chances uh, because of that and a couple for himself as well but with that guys thanks for tuning in I'll be signing out now and I'll catch you guys later